Hello viewers, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm about to do potato and mushroom kebab. Let me show you how I used to start my potato and mushroom kebab. This is my potato. Let me show you how I cut my potato. You see? And it. You see the way I cut the potato. This is the way I cut my potato. Then already, this is my mushroom. I cut it already. You know, it's I cut. You see how I did it. You see, I wash it already, and I put it. Then also I have another spices. You see, to put it so that it taste will come. Then also I have salt. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, see. After I put my spices inside, this is the way I used to do it, so that the ingredients will go everywhere. Then after I finish, I have to fry it in oil. You see, this is my oil. Hmm. Okay, now you see. Oil. You see how I did it so that I'll fly, I'll fly two times. Only five minutes I fly it. Now you see my potato. I fly it a little bit, not too much. Then this is my paprika, you see. You see the way I'm cutting it so that I will join it inside the then this is olive oil then my mushroom I put the olive oil then after I put the olive oil inside then after I put the olive oil inside this is salt then I put salt. Okay. Then after I put the salt inside, I have to mix it together with the olive oil so that the salt. You know, I wash everything before I bring it here. Then now, you see, I have stick. Okay. I put my potato here. Then my paprika. My mushroom. You see the way I did it. Then I put another potato. Then you see. If you like, you can put any meat you want. But for me, I used to use my mushroom like in me. And I'm there. See, I'm here. Then if you have, you know, kebab stick too, you can use that one too. Let me use that one to show you how I did it. You see, I put it inside, then paprika, then mushroom, and milk. No masadi, me the milk is no masafa. Potato no ba, and put another potato. Then the way you want, you can do do it. You can put normal meat. You see, then after I put it in this way, finish. You see the way I design it. After I finish, 
Then I have egg here. Also, let me put spice inside the egg, you know, so that the taste will go. The egg will have a little bit of taste. You know the way I'm doing it. After I mix the spices together with, if you like pepper, you can put powder pepper a little bit inside. Then after I did it this way, you know, I put it. You see the way I did it? I put it in this way. Then I have flour. It's some. You see the way I did it? You see the way I'm doing it? You see? Let me do it some now. Aye. Ahumi na. Into me any say we are after I finish. I put it here. You see? This is my potato and my mushroom kebab. You see the way I'm doing it? After I make the egg go everywhere, then I put it in my flour. This is my flour. It's some. Because you have to go to the Okay. You see my onions because if you want onions you can use onions too and join the paprika you know when you do this you see then this one I'll put the onion join the paprika and this is my mushroom See olive oil. I put olive oil inside the mushroom, then paprika, another paprika, then another potato. Then you see the way I, I'm doing it. I put another onion and mushroom. It depends the way you want. You can use meat, you can use chicken and doing it. Then after I finish. You see how I put the egg inside so that I can put the flour to you see the way I'm doing this. Okay, now you see how the egg go everywhere. You see the way you look, then I put my flour inside. After this one. I will show you how I put it in oven. Now you see, I finish my potato and mushroom kebab. You see the way I arrange it. Then the next step is I will put it in oven 10 to 15 minutes so that every ingredient will go inside. See how it looks. Please, if you are watching my video, please don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel and share my video for me then let's go let me show you how i put it in the oven okay now you see i put it in the oven 10 to 15 minutes so that you can do it after 10 minutes i will come back and see how you see how it looks then i have tomato mix oil together i mix it together then i have to put it inside you see the way i'm doing it let me bring it here so that you see it you see i put tomato and oil then after six minutes i remove it and put the tomato together with oil you know you see how you look okay. now wow. my potato the mushroom kebab you see how wow this one this one is finished then let me do the other one too 
So viewers, today I have a visitor, my apostle and his wife come and visit me today. Then I have potato and my mushroom kebab here. Then I want our apostle and his wife to taste and tell me how the food mm -hmm. tastes. Wow. Mm -hmm. Then apostle, you can eat. You see the way my potato. Ah, oh, this looks nice. Mm -hmm. It looks yummy, <laughs> yummy. Wow. Mm hmm. Mm. Apostle can see something. Hello, <laughs> my apostle. <laughs> Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I am Apostle Anthony. Mm -hmm. Beside me is my lovely wife. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I have been hearing of Mama Sewa Kishin. <laughs> Mama Sewa Kishin. Mama. Now I have got the opportunity to have a taste of his production. Mm -hmm. I really have to confess, this is good. Mm -hmm. This is tasting very nice. Mm -hmm. And I want to advise you all here, viewers, Mama Sewa Kishin. <laughs> this is the kitchen that has been introduced <laughs> that everything that you need that you want to talk about good food my YouTube. is Mama Sewa Kishin. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe on her YouTube and share it. And share it. Follow her up. Mm -hmm. But there is an advice to all women. Don't allow your husband to go to Mama Shawakishin alone. No. <laughs>